this beautiful Hornet. machine is the Super Hornet. It's the next generation of the F-18 Hornet. It's capable of carrying a much bigger payload, which means it can deliver a bigger knockout punch. After 25 years in the Navy's inventory, the F-A-18 Hornet was due for a major facelift. And boy, did it get it. Bigger engines made it faster and more powerful, but at the same time, it got a longer range, so now it can fly 40% further than before. I talked to pilot, Lieutenant Charlie Stoley Schwartz. So you are a pilot for a Super Hornet. What's the difference between a Super Hornet and the regular Hornet? A uh, Super Hornet, as opposed to the regular Hornet, uh, has a lot bigger wingspan, uh, has a few more wing stations that can carry a few more extra bombs. Basically, it's a little bit more advanced avionics and a few more advanced uh, weapon systems that we can carry on the jet. The twin-engine Super Hornet packs a vast array of awesome weapons. Its 11 weapon station can carry every air-to-air -air and air-to-ground weapon in the Navy's inventory. They're controlled by the pilot's helmet. A magnetic mounted tracker determines where the pilot's head is pointed and projects the information onto the pilot's visor. The head tracker and visor display act as a targeting device that can aim the plane's weapons wherever the pilot is looking. Whatever he's packing, they're fired with just the nod of the pilot's head. Our joint helmet mounted queuing system uh, gives us the ability to look, don't even have to point the jet and shoot. In the air, basically, when you're going through merges, meaning jets are coming right at each other, you just have the ability to keep running and uh, point and shoot. It's a great tool just to get away from your target as soon as possible, especially against the more advanced air-to-air -air threats. The Super Hornet is a true multi-role aircraft. It can perform virtually every mission in the tactical spectrum, including day or night strikes, suppression of enemy air defenses, maritime strikes, and reconnaissance. What capabilities does the Super Hornet actually give the Eisenhower? The Super Hornet actually gives the Eisenhower the capability to have a few less jets on the flight deck. We have the ability to give gas, play in a tanker role, and we also have the ability to, to uh, extend our time on station with the extra gas that the Super Hornet can carry. As a multi-mission strike fighter, the Super Hornet is an incredible machine. 